So hey everybody, greetings from Marimbula on the south coast of New South Wales. Look, it's a beautiful day here. The water's just lapping gently against the rocks very quietly. I'm reminded of a, a story that we told on the podcast just recently about leadership communication. And uh, this event happened on the 4th of April, 1988. Uh, I was at the Air Force Base in Western Australia, RAF Base Pierce, and a Mackie aircraft, a, a jet trainer, flown by a student pilot was coming into land and what the, um, the, the pilot experienced uh, an engine failure. He was unable to relight the engine and eventually had to eject and the aircraft was completely destroyed but the pilot was fine. The crash investigator as we were digging the aircraft wreckage out of the ground he explained something he said this wasn't mechanical failure this was pilot error. And I went oh that's interesting and he explained that on the control column on the, so the, the, the aircraft is flown via control column. On the control column, the relight button, right? So the engine fails, you relight it using the relight button. Anyway, next to the relight button is the transmit button for the radio. And because he, was, he had no, very little time to get the engine relit, the pilot was panicking. Instead of pushing the relight button, he was pushing the transmit button. And he was swearing, he's going, light you mother, light you mother. He was actually using a far worse language than that um, because the, the engine wouldn't relight. Now, the air traffic controllers knew what he was doing they, because this had happened before. He had his finger on the transmit button, but because he had his finger on the transmit button and was just transmitting, he couldn't hear. And he couldn't hear the air traffic controllers saying, you're, all, you're pushing the wrong button. You're pushing. Anyway, of course, eventually he ran out of time. He had to eject. But the lesson for us as leaders is if we just spend all our time with our finger on the transmit button, then we're missing a whole huge part of communica communication, which is listening to our organisation, hearing what they're saying. And if we're just transmitting messages, we don't know whether they're getting to the right people or they're being understood. Anyway, that story or that experience uh, taught me an important lesson about leadership. And one thing I say to people is, look, when you're doing communication, take your finger off the transmit button can have a big difference, uh, improve your, your organisational communication and help make your organisations more humane places to work. That's it from Marimbula in New South Wales. See you again next time.